Right, I have here a L29 um, 3D shield with an ESP chip on. It's connected up to a NEMA 14 stepper motor, uh, 400 steps per revolution. And I've got it powered off 9 volts. I've got this uh, jumper position closest to the chip. And I've got this little white switch here fully depressed to apply power to the board. And I've got the NEMA, connector, NEMA motor connected up to uh, these four top pins. There's no USB cable connected, so uh, let's get cracking and uh, show this I've ripping. got the ESP chip running in um, access mode. So what we need to do is connect to the access point. Um, so it's the, uh, it's the same password as the access point name and we want to be able to run the MyFocuser Pro 2E software which is this and the access point is actually 192.168.4.1 and the port number is 220 so if I click connect I should be able to connect to the focuser and I have so uh, let me just turn coil power off so if I go it's a 400 step NEMA motor so if I go 500 steps it should be one revolution in a bit so wait goes You can see that the motion's a little bit erratic, but it's fine. It's working. And back the other way. So you can see it moving forwards and backwards. Uh, speed doesn't work, of course, in the firmware. So no point changing the motor speeds. So that's about one and a quarter steps. Um, so we've got we've got this working with the NEMA stepper motor. The software though is MyFocuser Pro 2E um, dot NEMA dot L293D. So let me just disconnect from here, and I'll show you working with the uh, 28BY motor now. Right. So I have here the uh, 28BY motor actually connected. Uh, to this device, I'm powering it off 9 volts um, the wiring of course is uh, for the for the 28BY uh, starting from the top here is uh, blue, pink, yellow, orange, red and don't worry about the fact that these wires are the, are the wrong colour it's because I have an a, in between cable right, so I'm powering it off 9 volts and we are uh, here connected to the uh, access point um, so let me just connect to it again there we go so I'm connected if I go plus 500 the stepper motor is going to slowly move you can see that moving now um, it is quite slow because it is a geared motor uh, 2048 odd steps uh, per revolution so it's gone uh, 500 steps let me go back the other way and you can see it's quite happily rotating uh, in, in both directions and uh, no problem at all and this is using the MyFocuser Pro 2E.28BYJ.L293D software so we have the motor focuser shield actually running I don't have a temperature probe connected yet um, so that's still to test but the motor functionality is actually working um, okay so um, I've got this powered from 9 volts, uh, a 9 volt power supply uh, connected to the bottom two uh, connections here and I've got the jumper switch um, and it's in the position closest to the ESP chip, that jumper switch which allows a VN to be powered from the 9 volts. I've got this white switch depressed, now it's really really important that you in this mode here that you don't apply more than 9 volts to the input if you apply 12 uh, you're going to get some really strange results uh, with the controller timing out and doing all sorts of strange things so don't exceed 9 volts um, on that on that particular input the bottom two right so I've got a really small stepper motor here it's a CHS GM12 well, CHS dash GM12 15BY. It's got a ratio of 1 to 298. It's got a fair bit of torque um, for such a small motor. Um, and uh, I've connected this up 
the same way as for a NEMA motor so um, what we'll do is we'll load the NEMA software and we'll test this right so let's connect uh, I'll just reprogram the controller let's connect uh, to the uh, access point load up my focus of Pro 2E uh, software let's connect to the controller and I'll tell it to go 500 steps now I can actually feel it pulsing oh, you may be able to see this move it is in fact moving it's moving in uh, anti-clockwise direction according to me probably clockwise according to you so that's uh, so let's go um, the opposite direction a thousand steps so it's going around this way now this is uh, for such a small stepper motor um, 198 uh, sorry 298 um, steps per per revolution um, that's the gearing on it uh, it's actually quite a good stepper motor and uh, if you were using it on a guide scope or SCT um, it's actually quite a viable uh, solution the, they're about $12 I think um, from eBay um, very small as you can see I'm <laughs> I'm holding it uh, between my thumb and finger but she's got plenty of torque but uh, a lot more torque than the 28 by chain motors so uh, this is working fine with the NEMA software